all right guys no slacking sports we are here back at the net house baby for the snl jets monday practice um we have one more game before our willie starter classic starts right here against this team from frisco called mission something um the boy just got finished warming up stretching uh, again i told you guys for practice i'm not really gonna try to show that um, i'm wait till they get active um in a in a practice but um this past week saturday man against piedmont bro hey man we was man we could you know what I, i'm not really caring about that loss really honestly um either though of course you know i, I always want to win when we come out here but that game showed me a lot with these boys that is that you know we could compete with some of the best teams out here um like i always say to you guys man i don't care about our league you know i'll start caring once i see see the league more uh competitive like our non-league i love our non-league games man because those teams in those non-leagues are our competitive ball clubs and um and i like to see that uh you know, of course, you going you you might get some in non league that's not as top tier, but it's gonna be more better ones than non. You know what I'm saying? So, but one thing I um I, like I said, I saw from Piedmont game, man, we we competed, man, and um you know our pitching just gotta um it, like I said, we we good, but we just gotta get a little bit more, a little bit more um seasoned, you know. When we facing great ball clubs like that, like like our pitching, when we facing against teams that can hit like that, we have to, you know, it's it's two things we can do, you know, pitch our tails off, which we we which we were, um, up to a certain point, and then um, and then uh, or or um, you know, have our defense solid as hell, you know, and we had some mental mistakes. On our defense side of things that actually held us back from really tell you the truth winning that game um our defense and then you know our pitching a little bit a little bit but but again you can't take away from another team that can hit the ball no matter what our pitching do you know what i mean if, if we can go pitcher for pitcher if we could go back and forth like that then and and let it go down to the wire then i'm fine with that I, i'm totally fine with that um but when it comes to like you know we start off like that, back and forth, and then down the line, we just started fading away because of our pitching and then our defense. Then that's where that part we gotta, you know, we definitely gotta start buckling down and start getting better at. Um, but that game was very interesting and, and very um, enjoyable, you know. Either though we lost, you know, we we was right there. It was it was six five, what top of the fifth or bottom of the fifth. Um, and then they just started scoring, started hitting the ball. We had a little, we had a, a few errors that led to scores and and stuff like that. You know what I mean? So we was there, like we was there again. And, you know, our pitching. You you give us a fifty percent chance, then I I take that from any pitcher of ours. Like I don't want to give them anything. Like let them earn it, and, and I respect that. You know, I will respect the pitcher. I will respect the team for earning their hits you know what i'm saying not us just walking them and um you know hit by pitches and stuff like that like let a team earn it earn it man and i will i will definitely totally respect that from both sides um from the pitcher and um you know for the pitcher standpoint as in helping us get out any way we can you know and um and for the offense side um of the of that team and them hitting the ball you know what i'm saying like so hey hey great game at piedmont um unfortunately we couldn't pull it out man 13-6 but but again that was a great game you know what i mean from from start to finish that was a great game i just wish our um our defense would have held a little bit stronger and our pitching would have been a little bit better but again i'm not gonna i can't take away from piedmont's hitting they, they got some hitters over there you know what i mean and know how to put the ball in play and where to put the ball in play at so it's, it's so again great team but we could learn learn from from that game for sure you know what i mean and and know what we need to do more of and get better at you know 
when we're facing um, teams that get hit. But all right, man, let me go up today practice. Um, but before I go, I got to show you and tell you this. We just start the field. Let's go, Jets. <laughs> way through the day. Volleyball. Over. Get that out of here. But um, all right, man, look, I'm about to head up and uh, show you the rest of their practice, man. They, they're throwing now, so um, I'm let them do what they got to do here. As in throwing and getting themselves getting themselves ready and prepared. So, all right, y'all. Oh, oh man, no little hiccups. Um, look, you see the boys? Yes, sir. But, um, all right, y'all. Let me um head up, put my little bag down, and I'll see y'all when um when these boys get active, active within their day. Yes, sir. Look at the track squad. Uh huh. Good for background as always. Let me go. Let's let me zoom in out there, out there. Yeah, yeah. You see it? Beautiful. But I'm Archer. I'll see y'all in a minute once they get active. Let's go. All right, y'all. Um, these boys are doing situational drills or situation drills. <laughs> I like saying situation. All right. And um, I'm gonna go and show a little bit of this. You know. Situation, so I ain't gonna be here too long. Good throw. Good throw. Yeah, man. Look, um, like I was saying about uh, that game against Piedmont. Uh, like I said, we had some, we had some mental errors, man. Um, a couple of them, you know, that led to a lot of things. Um, let your runs too as well so at the end of the day man we just gotta you know <laughs> some things man you can't um you know you can't control a little bit of you know what i mean like you know errors are gonna happen in games um you know teams are gonna hit the ball so um some things you can't can't change you know what I mean but at the end of the day uh, you know we was there we, we, we was there man we was definitely competing I mean our first we was on fire our first you know what I'm saying three innings man and then from there it just started sizzling a little bit um, but at the end of the day man um, it's okay like I said we can learn from all of that and uh, learn from teams that can hit the ball we just gotta have solid D, man. We just gotta have, gotta have solid D. If we, if we don't have solid D, man, then you know it's gonna be tough. But again, I, you know, when y'all hear me say I, I never worry about the D, I don't, because eventually they gonna they'll, they'll pull through. Like when it comes to this like high school stuff, it's always gonna. You know, of course, you want everything to work at at at, at one time. You know what I mean? Or, like offense, defense, the hitting, all the all the good the pitching. You want everything to be like a hundred, and that's not ideal. You know what I mean? So if we can choose on which on which things that we can actually be dominant in, I want the pitching and the hitting. Like I'll let the defense be what it is. You know what I'm saying? Um, At the end of the day, you know, it's a, 
you know, that's what's going to keep us in the game, not just defense, you know. Of course, everyone's in defense. Defense wins games. Yeah, a lot of things win games, though. You know what I mean? Your defense can be good, but shit, if we ain't hitting the ball, then what? <laughs> if we, if our defense is great and our pitching is sucks, then what? You know what I'm saying? So, again, we want everything to be great in one day of the game. But if I had a choice on what I want to have done, I want my pitching to be straight and I want my hitting to be straight. That's it. You know what I mean? Let, I, let the defense do its thing and let that play out. You know what I mean? So, you know, we got some great defensive players. They just got to make the plays. You know what I'm saying? So, um, all right, y'all. Um, I'm going to let this last one here go. And then um, I'll be back with you guys after they're doing something different than this. So, it is. All right, y'all. I'll be back once they're doing something than situational drills. Let's go. All right, guys. Um, after the boys got finished doing situational drills with the outfitters, um, now they they just staying in, inside with the infielders with a couple of base runners. So, um Let's go, man. Um, actually, Anthony, they already went one one time around. Um, this is their second go. So I'm going to start with Ant, and then once you see Ant get back up, if they do this again, then um, I end it there. And uh, record whatever next. They come, um, they come back whatever next they do after this, either um, hitting. Um, I don't think they're gonna bring the bubble out, but I mean they they can do some soft toss or hit or or whatever the case may be. But, but again, like I said, one thing get back get back up here or maybe they stay at or he gets back up at first if they stay at first with their base runners then um. Then um, I'll be back with y'all for something else. Um, but again, like I said, man, it gets beat, my man. We just had a lot of errors, man. A lot of errors. Um, I think I want to go back and check and see how many errors that they actually recorded for Max Prep. So um, They already Get went. So he doing our first or third. So, all right, y'all. I'll be back when they doing something different. Let's go. All right, guys. Um, the boys, right after they got finished doing their uh, infield with the base runners, um, they're doing pretty much live situations with the batters hitting now. So, um, might record the batters twice if they allowing the batters to go twice. But um, start right now with Jonah. Let's get it. Oh, and, they, um, and they go in two counts. Like two two count or whatever count, but they with the strike two count. Alright, you see? Yep. Let's go. Next batter. Crack. Let's get it. Should have pushed it, but my battery pack failed. But good catch, man. Alright, uh, let's go. Get back over there, dog. <laughs> Either him or food. One of the two. 
Alright. Uh, oh, Pitt's about to hit now. He just wanted him to lay the button down. I know where that ball is. Yeah, we'll take it. As long as you barrel, man, I don't care. All right, back to Jonah. Uh, so I will record the batter if this is going twice. That'll be it. Say if you land in that bucket, it would have been nice. Hey man, I ain't mad with you now. Let's go. There you go. Let's go. There you go. Foul it. I'll get you. Ooh. Yeah, you can't do nothing about that. <laughs> he was already out. <laughs> hey, what a backup, Ant. Let's go. Uh, once I see Jonah back, coming back up, then uh, next group in. Let's go. Pick it up in there. Ah. Uh, That's better, Pip. Let's go. And then, uh, like again, once Jonah get back up, I'll be back with the next one coming in. All right, y'all. I'll be back with the next group in. Let's get it. All right, y'all. Um, we have a group change. Um, actually, Pooh started it off, but Ansel like I think the last batter. So I'm just gonna start here. So let's go. Come on. Let's go. Fire. Oscar there. So who, who's in this group is uh Pooch. Well Ao is gonna be in everybody group. Um Leo and Oscar. Uh, so Pooch was the first one at bat, so there we go. <laughs> right at the fence. Where you get that run in? Got to go out and practice. Hey, you doing in practice, you're doing in the game. That's what I was told you. That's what I was told. So, Alright, let's go, Aldo. Let's go, 
probably up. Let's go in. They pretty much going in a, like the, the bat lineup. Go boy, peace. That's off the net. Go boy. Good hitting coming along, baby. Let's go. Oh, there you go. Ah. That might drop. Hey, nice try. Let's try it, Tay. All right, man. Find a way. Let's go. See Foots come back, uh, see you with the next group. Nice throw, though. Nice throw, though. Uh, one, one, one. Alright, Foots coming back up. So, uh, I'll see y'all with the next group that comes in the hit. Let's get it. Alright, y'all. Um, last group of the day. Um, we got uh, Matan, Huddy, Zach, Mateo, Darren. Oh, that was Matan on the pop up. Oh, just two rounds. That's it. Let's go. Go ahead. 
Poke that. I'm gonna take it. Oh, oh. Hey, Mateo, you need to sit back a little. Second round, Mateo. Oh, no, not Mateo, Matan. time back up then um i'll be back with these boys either um doing something else after this or exiting out of out of here so and saying the infamous yet He got it down. <laughs> Alright, Taylor, let's go. Ah, just miss it again. Alright, let's go, dear. They recorded everybody twice here. All right, Joe. Um, I'll be back once these boys say the infamous yes and exit. I'm out of here. There you go. All right, Joe. See you in a minute. Let's go. All right, guys. Uh, practice is over with. Uh, they said the infamous yes hella fast. Um, they were t talking in a group. Sorry guys um, on the camera twisting around, but um, Coaches knew they were talking and stuff like that and um, as soon as they wrapped up They said the Jets. I couldn't couldn't record fast enough. So all right y'all look this is how good y'all see y'all hear him Hear him say it and y'all see it all the time. So all good Now I'm out of here man heading to the crib um, Get ready to go to work 
I got a game tomorrow at Aurora. Towards my job once again. <laughs> uh, I'm going to be late for work too again. Once again. Or I can just go in and clock in early. Come back. Drop them off. Then go back to work again. I, that's the only thing I hate about games on my work day. That's tourist that way. Because, you know, um, the school only got two vans. So we might not be able to get it. Majority of the time we don't get it. We have to take ourselves. So, um, hey man, it's all good. Uh, so this will be our last game until um, our Willie Classic that starts next week. So, um, hey man, let's try to go get this Willie Stargell, man. I want another. We got another chance. Last year we came in what? Second place or third place? Third place? Yeah, third. Um, this year, let's let's win it. You know, let's have a Willie Stargell for these boys under their belt, man. Especially for the seniors that get up out of here. You know, at least they have one of those under their belt. You know, of course, I want my son to get one. I mean, shoot, I got one. At least get that. You know, but if he, you know, if he don't, then it's all good. He got something that I ain't get. He got a the MVP player of the year. He got that. And um, but it was kind of tough, man. Um, during my time, man, on on trying to get it, man, I was I was playing against and playing with some great ball players, man. So. You know, honestly, anybody on our NSNL team could have got that thing, but they gave it to the one that they that that deserved it at the time. I, I believe it was Shamari Beverly, um, my junior year. So, so it's all good. Um, I think I think in the next year, uh, they gave it to I think um, Antoine Rollins. I think I have to go back and check that. But all good, man. But let's go, man. I'll see y'all tomorrow at Aurora. So until next time, ladies and gents, no slacking sports. We never slack on what we do, baby. Let go.